The following recording is done between Merlin and Mr. Hugo. Merlin runs a mini retreat sessions as a preparation for longer retreats, as long as two weeks in complete continuous darkness. Mr. Hugo hosts the Road to the IPO podcast, an entrepreneur, artist, influencer, and many more. When we say in the dark, it should be completely dark. Yeah. And uh, there shouldn't be any little spot of light coming in. What do we mean by having a retreat in a complete darkness? Okay. okay, so can you check? Do you see any so far? So I can hide. Do you see any? In this side here, maybe? No. Okay, so far, but so good. So far, so good. I don't see any on that side, no. I don't see Okay, it. perfect. So, yeah, you can put your... Uh, I would be um, on the massage table. Okay. So your space is all yours. Okay. You can take a candle off even. Yes, yeah. <coughs> no, so I put it off from the... <laughs> okay. Sorry. <laughs> so you, you like to be in a cave, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> so I would invite you to Peru. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay. I'm sorry. So, so yeah, the mic is on, so yeah. everything is okay. Okay, so yeah, probably you should invite us uh, one day to Peru. Yeah. And then we'll do a retreat in complete darkness somewhere. <laughs> uh, we manage a place. <laughs> okay, that, that would be good. It cool. makes sense, right? Yeah, that would be fun, yeah. Okay, so you relax, uh, take deep breath. Okay, and you keep your eyes open, by the way. Yeah. So basically, a true retreat in darkness should be a minimum of four days. Okay. Why? Because scientifically speaking, in four days, there's the brain chemistry with a change. Oh, uh, yeah? Okay, before four days, that won't happen. Okay. Okay. And this is uh, basically goes to something called uh, the melatonin. Okay. Uh, which is uh, the brain would uh, uh, manufacture, especially in the dark. Okay. So when we go to sleep for one reason, because the melatonin would uh, be more. Yeah. The brain goes on uh, spreading that uh, kind, let's say, of hormone. Okay. Okay. So we say serotonin uh, is... It transforms to melatonin and it becomes uh, condensed, it becomes uh, more, let's say, uh, even that can be measured in uh, milligrams and then it becomes in some quantity of grams and so on. Okay. As much as melatonin is uh, accumulated, as much as you get to deeper consciousness or deeper, let's say, uh, touch with dimensions, different dimensions okay. would, would open to you. Okay, other dimensions, they open to you, okay related to the pineal gland okay within so they were able i mean to uh, figure out what happens in the dark now we are in a mini retreat and this goes usually 30 minutes to 40 it can be up to an hour it can be up to four hours okay one has to get used to some kind of techniques that would uh, enable that person to shift to a longer retreat okay for a true retreat, I mean, to happen, there should be some kind of uh, techniques accompanied uh, with the person in order to let be able to face the darkness, uh, face the shadow within, face the fear okay. that would uh, rise up. All right. Okay. So this is like a preparation. Before. It's a, like a preparation. Okay. Now, we shouldn't talk at all. Okay. Okay. But for the, say, the experience to happen, uh, that won't happen within 30 minutes, even an hour. Okay. Okay. I would make some, let's say, excitement, uh, some kind of surprises for you. Okay. And I want to put you in a situation that uh, a normal person would face 
in a retreat of four days up to seven days, let's say. Okay, okay, good. Okay, so you take a deep breath, relax. I would spend like five minutes uh, in silence. So try to look uh, to the horizon in front of you. Uh, you look with your eyes open. So you look to the horizon in front of you. Mm -hmm. uh, you look to the infinity. And you drop a smile on your face and you relax. If you feel at any moment you want to close your eyes, you do so. Uh, opening or closing are the same. Now, if I ask you to stand up and let's say move two steps forward. Okay, and uh, keep your things. Yeah. So, move two steps forward. Okay. Okay, and let's say. Um, S just circle within your own uh, location, just circle a little, yeah, circle a little, okay, and you stop, and I ask you, go back to your place. Now, if you can figure out from my voice where am I located. Yeah. <coughs> Were you able to? Um, the same place? Yeah. Mm -hmm. You are in? Yeah. Even if you are not in the same place, it doesn't matter. Okay. But you are somewhere, right? Yeah, I mean, I'm sitting down. Are you in the same place? I think so, yeah. Okay, shift to the place beside you, any place. Okay. You are able to, right? Yeah. I'm, okay. I'm there. To some extent. Okay, perfect. Cool. And again, you look to the horizon. Uh, with eyes open or even with your eyes closed. And try to capture a, a point which is so far, far, far upon looking to the infinite. Try to capture one point which yes. is so far to the infinite. Now it can be with your open eyes or even it can be closed. Okay. So which one are you doing? Open eyes. Okay. 
So to capture it means uh, you look at that single point and then you close your eyes, you keep it in your memory. Okay. So try to capture that point. If you can't do it with closed eyes, you can open and then capture that point, close your eyes yes. and keep looking to that single point which is far um, up to the horizon. Yes. And that's it. You relax. Take deep breath. Okay, so how do you feel so far? Uh, there's a little bit of tension, mm -hmm. and I don't know why, but uh, I'm getting used to. Uh, I'm with, right now with my eye closed, so okay. So it doesn't like feel like it's the same. It feels, it feels the same like opening mm -hmm. closed. Okay. And yeah. uh, do you feel like your senses? Uh, so you cannot see. There is no uh, noise, you cannot hear. Yeah, but I. There is no movement, you are not touching. No. There is no nothing like you cannot smell, even you cannot taste. There is no taste, smell, no. hearing, well, I... seeing. Mm -hmm. So all your senses are not active. Yeah. What happens in uh, complete darkness? Okay. that there would be techniques to turn your senses inwards so you would see in, you would hear in, taste, touch and smell in within yourself Wait, okay, within yourself no, yeah, okay. so we revive the connection okay. in between mind, body and the soul okay wow. okay, so I want to ask you, do you know where is your jacket, right? If not, to my I left. Mean, the, I okay. I'm, I'm, where I am right now, it's my left near okay. the door. Are you able to move, bring it on to your side, bring it next to you? Uh, I stand up? Yeah, take your time. Okay. Slowly. Exactly, I don't know where it is. Like <laughs> this. Like this. Like this. Like this. This is okay. Yeah, I'm gonna go back to my place. Yeah, to your place. Yeah. Slowly. Yeah. Okay. All right. Got it. Okay. 
<laughs> so you are happy you get it. Yeah. Do you have any question? Well, I even if it's dark, I can see some lights. Not they're not from outside, but they like I don't know some. Well, what are these? So. Um. Like. Uh, maybe because I'm getting um, I'm getting used to the dark, so I'm like seeing some. Because uh, I have right now with my eyes open, so I see like lights. I don't know if they come from outside or no. But before, when I didn't, when I was not used to the dark, now I didn't see it. But now I can see some like re reflex lights. Mm. I don't know. Okay, you can check it. You look at your hand. Yeah, I can. Yeah, check. <laughs> I can check. I can see my. Well, I cannot see my hands hand, but I feel them. Oh, you, can, you can feel. Okay. Uh, yeah. what, what kind? If you want to describe that uh, color of that light, what is it? it green, is... green, like fuel. Green uh, flashing, a little bit. Uh, okay, so if you look at your hands, you can you can see this. Uh, well, my hands kind of light. My hands, they're, they're black. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah. You cannot see your hand. Well, I I, I feel the you know I can see the. Um, Let's say I this is surrounding. The surroundings of my hand, yeah, like like okay. some shadows, yeah. Uh huh. Yeah. Okay. And uh, how how again you describe those uh, those lights? Yeah. Let's say the hue. What kind of colors do you see? Yeah. Well, it's not green green, but it's a little bit green. But they are they are like like um, you know flashes. Flashes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So okay. do you uh, see mine? What? So I am far from you. Do you see any lights? Uh, and and you know I don't see anything. Yeah. But I, I know you are over there. Yeah. You are getting something like for the aura. So the aura is yeah. the faint light of energy that surrounds your being. Okay. It's a reflection of your cells, okay. uh, vibration, and the energy that it holds. Okay. Yeah, each one would get it in a different uh, color, let's say. Like in your body or like outside? Or outside. On the it would yeah, be yeah, surrounding like... you from the outer, yeah. outer shell. Yeah. yeah, I see it on the wall, so. Okay. Wow. So this for a few minutes. In... So imagine if you spend, let's say, a day, two days, three days, and even more. So what happened? Yeah, you would see uh, the aura of objects even surrounding you. Okay. Uh, and those auras usually it like extend uh, much more than the object itself. Okay. What do you mean, like extend? Yeah. So, for example, uh, the table. Let's say in real, it is uh, let's say three meters far from you, uh -huh. but you may feel it is like one meter uh, only. So uh -huh. you would see its reflection of its aura uh, much closer to you. Okay. Okay. Yeah, Why? Because it extends. Because it's a, uh, an extension of its real location. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Uh, same for you. So, the the aura would extend your skin. It it surrounds your. That's yeah. A, if I see my my hands, I can see the suits and the. Yeah. Okay. So let's say hands. move your hands or play with your fingers and then figure out uh, if they move along or not. Well, they seem bigger. <laughs> They're black, but. Uh -huh. So you can feel it. It's like some kind of a silhouette. You know, I don't know how to say it's like the the image of the, my hands. Yeah. But the, the fingers seem because it, they seem bigger and they seem mm -hmm. black. Mm -hmm. They are black, but I can. Yeah. Like oh yeah. Yeah. Even scientifically speaking, there's nothing like a blackness. By the way, they they discovered that the whole universe is covered by uh, dark violet. Okay. Dark violet light because it's at its extreme uh, frequency. The higher frequency in the universe is that of the violet, dark violet light. Okay. So in fact, there's nothing like blackness in the universe. It's it's just a dark violet. Okay. So okay. So it's no black. It's there's nothing like black. Yeah. Oh yeah. That's what the science says. So, so that when we are in the dark, 
what we actually see is in dark. Yeah, actually violet. you are in dark violet. Oh, wow. It's violet. So if you, let's say, yeah, uh, they took it to, or they'd say capture it, uh, and they have done experiments, and they measured the frequency of, uh, and it is categorized as dark violet. Okay. Oh, wow. Okay, good. So again, you look to the horizon and try to capture light. If you if you see any dot of light far, 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 just try to capture it and you close your eyes. Okay. You capture it by having your eyes open, then you close, keep the memory in. So if you see light. Yes. Okay, just try to capture it with your eyes. So you look at it, yeah. and you grab it in your eyes, and you take a deep breath. So you capture it, and you hold it with it. So, are you able to do it? Yeah. Again, if you see, if you see. I saw, I saw, and I captured Okay, so try to capture it. Capture it, you look at it, as if you are very close. Let's say you can eat it with your eyes. Capture it, and hold it by closing your eyes. Uh, take a deep breath. And you keep it within. Uh, so you hold it to them, you capture it, you hold it, you own it, so it belongs to you. So if you see light, okay, try to yes. capture, try yeah. to capture any. Okay, you see. The one that you like, try to capture. Okay. And then take a deep breath and you take it in. Take a deep breath. You may open and close, open and close till you till you capture the most dot of that light. Okay. And you keep it in the memory of capturing. And you keep capturing it. Okay. Yes. So we want to do some action. Uh, if you stand up again, please, and then move uh, two steps forward. Okay, and Jeez. Okay. two steps forward. Okay, and just uh, talk about any 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 about your experience. Do you have any questions so far? Uh, so far, yeah. Um, I don't know. When you're in the dark, I think um, just just starting to get in tune with your body. Mm -hmm. So any any pain, any injury that you have and that you like you don't really think about in, in your days because you were so stressed and you, you do a lot. When yeah. you just stay calm here you they come back. Mm. I mean maybe some pain or from the past just come back. Injuries and you know the, uh, the, the okay. feeling of that injury comes back. Uh, That's why I got just now. Yeah. So I felt like I had like some pain in my ankle because I had an injury uh -huh. in my ankle. So, mm. but it usually doesn't hurt. Right. But now I was in the dark. It just came back to me. Like my back. body was in tune wow. with my, my my mind was in tune with, with, with my body. I mean. Okay. Yeah. Okay. okay. Can you move uh, three steps to the right? To the right. Three steps to the right. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Three. three. Okay. Three. And one to the front. Uh -huh. okay. okay, we go left. We uh -huh. go to the left. Okay. Okay, and I ask you, go back slowly to your place. 
what I was right now. Yeah, but you should move. I mean, look to the place that you were in. Yeah. At so the beginning, beginning. Uh, yeah. Okay, at the beginning I was uh, so slowly. I was here. I think here, here. I think maybe there. All right. Okay. Well, the room is so. Uh, it's not that big, <laughs> otherwise you would be lost, right? Okay, I got it. I'm, I'm, I'm there. <laughs> but you are able. Okay. So can you tell the feeling while you are searching? Like, uh, well, I... Uh... What do you think? Like, is there any moment of some kind, I don't know, can you describe? Is there any gap? Uh... No, because I'm, I think... I was just searching because not mm. to fall to fall down, you know. Yeah. There is something on the on the floor, or maybe so. Yeah. Usually, when you are in the dark, you always tend to uh, to put your hands in front just yeah. to see right. the stuff. Touch, yeah, by touch. But yeah. he, if he, now that you say it, I, I don't think we, we we need it. Yeah. You can I can I can, after like uh, after being in the, in the dark room, you can you get used to to it, yeah. so you can just walk around without your hands like that. Okay. So yeah, but normally people they they tend to put their hands in front just to uh, mm -hmm. to fill mm -hmm. the space, you know. Yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah. So within a short period of time, for sure, you won't feel that fear. I mean, uh, yeah. is there any moment uh, special? Let's say. Uh, well, when uh, you told me to go in front and then a little bit to the right, then I was just putting my hand to see you were there. In front. Where's that right? Yeah. Where, where you are, like, so I'm like, oh, it's, it's melting there, so I'm like, I don't want uh, to... Uh, yeah, but you weren't lost. If you were lost, it would be something else. I'm not, I'm not lost. I think I got the, the space, so I come back to my space uh, easily. Yeah. yeah. So I don't think I, got, I get lost. Mm -hmm. Okay, so it, you can turn uh, your candle on. Okay. Don't even know what they see. Yeah. I don't even know what they see. <laughs> Have you got it? Uh, no. Okay, I search for it. it. I got it. To, uh, yeah, take to, your time. To feel. Um, we are not in a hurry. <laughs> so we have the whole day. <laughs> <laughs> I try to. Yeah. Well, this day out. The small thing. Okay, so touch it from all directions and then you can reach. Just in camera. Okay. Got yeah. it. Okay. About to come from here. It was on. Yeah, it was on, but I just. Uh... Oh no! Oh, okay. It's just me. Okay. Maybe. Okay. <laughs> okay. Yeah, so you have it. 